because I filmed the other one so early in the morning that it is kind of all over the place. Um, but today we are, we have gone on a bit of a road trip to two places. We went to Lyme Regis and we also went to Weymouth. So I thought I'd bring you along because there's loads of really nice kind of scenery there. It's got a really gorgeous beach and also there's loads of really awesome shops. So enjoy. Hi guys and girls. We are currently on our way to Lyme Regis. It's like two, three hours from where we live, so I thought I would bring you along with us. So we've just had. Hi guys. <laughs> Today, I'm going to be reviewing this McDonald's ice mocha frappuccino. We just had breakfast. We're what, like a quarter of the way? Well, a quarter. A sixth of the way. So, uh, yeah. <clears throat> Let's go. idea of doing the park and ride is a failure because the gate shut so scrap what I told you in the last clip we are now going to be driving to the other car park. Uh, we could go to the one that's kind of down the end of that shop. Uh, kind of. Well also new car tour. This is my favorite bit. Yes. Big car park up on the wall. There was. I have walked up here on like a ghost tour once. successfully made it, thanks to Mike. <laughs> um, we ended up parking in the car park that's like halfway down the hill. Uh, so yeah, we're just walking down now to the beach, which isn't too far away. Just trying to see what... We have made it to the beach. Prime ice cream location up there, just saying. So we're just walking down the beach because last time we came here there was this like weird shop, I don't know what it was called, um, but it was like a little like vintagey like thrift like Aladdin's cave and Aladdin's cave kind of like a, a thing. So we're gonna go there. Hopefully it is open because today is a bank holiday. I love these like fossil lights and a, a seagull, I love seagulls. So this was the shop that we were trying to go into, however it does suggest, oh it's open from 11 that's why, that took me way too long to work out. This is where I had some fine pina coladas, recommend for those who like pina coladas. Here is the lifeboat, I think we're planning to walk like across the harbour wall over there to have a look because I don't think anything's really open until like 11. So we're just going to go for a walk and someone lost their croc. We're going on the danger route. This is the route for beginners. This is the route for risk takers. Danger. There is a slight wind but I wouldn't say it's high. Actually ridiculous. How on 
down those is just beyond me. There are some insane looking steps coming up. I don't want to like fall off to show you. Let me get a bit closer. The sea, I do not understand how people are running on this wall. It's so like just wibbly. Right, have a look at these stairs. They're just like blocks coming out. Look. <laughs> these are like actual terrifying. Definitely not going down there. Because I think it's job you see it how it is. Literally so pretty from here as well. As I said, I hope it's not too windy, my audio. I'm filming on my new phone, so who knows? Oh, my there's aquarium there. Let's go see the fish. So here is the town. We've just come to like the end of the walkway thingy there. Uh, apparently there's no way to get down this way, so you have to walk all the way back. But um we really want to go to that aquarium, which is there. I don't know if it'll be open. Everything seems to be shut at the moment, but I think it could partly be because it's like a bank holiday. Partly because... Okay, how do we get into this aquarium? Aha! How exciting! Yes! Let's feed Finn. Look at these cute guys. Let's have these rates for merchandise. So every ton of oil was one pound, I'm guessing. Every ton of sand taken within the cob. 60p. Well, it's probably not in pounds, it's probably in like shillings. Update, um, we didn't go to the aquarium yet because it was super expensive to go into. So instead, have fun looking at these clips of nets which may have once had fish in them. Because it is England and because I love seagulls, it is now raining, which is great. So we're just going to the arcade now that it's open. Mike is just being rude, as usual. Luckily it's finished raining. Now in here last time there was a um, fortune telling thing that I really liked so I'm going to see if I can find it again. Waiting for Come Mike. Over. Waiting for, for a Mike. small fee, okay. Zoltar will give you a wealth of wisdom. Which one does it go in now? Oh. You may have heard this, but Zoltar is here to tell you you can believe it. Age is simply a matter of mind. Thank if you, you don't mind, then my friend, it doesn't matter. Go, so go on. Be carefree like a little baby. I but did. first, give Zoltar a little money and I will give you a fortune. I just thought, oh, thanks. You just asked for more money. <laughs> Ooh. Yay, good luck in a month or two. My lucky number isn't on there. Mike's gonna win me some sick jewels. I don't have any 10 piece. Mike's not gonna win me some sick jewels. I love this game, you always win. Uh, that one looks quite good. Ooh. 
guy is treading on a rock. What are you up to? I've ever seen in my life. Do you want anything? Yeah. You're winning a minion. Well, typical England, it's now horrendously sunny. Uh, the rain has completely gone. So we're gonna walk back up to the town now. They have some really cool like fossil shops and stuff, loads of pasty shops and ice cream shops. And then we'll come back down to the Aladdin Cave one a bit later. It only opens in 20 minutes, but still 20 minutes we'll have to hang around. So cute. That is a statement. Mmm. Bacon roll with Christmas apparently. Yeah, you have to go in here. This is the uh, creme de la creme of fossils. This is pretty cool. Amethyst bracelet. This is my first time in my life I've ever seen a Twingies. Ooh, they're heavier than I expected. And these things. I think these are like the, is this like the American section? These, ooh, Hershey's. I think that's American. Do let me know. Ooh, Mike and Ike. I was sent these once by, I think I got them in my Halloween saw box. I'm gonna go get some sun cream because I am pale and I don't want to burn. Hmm. Got those UVA stars. Love that dragon. I have these dragons outside my house. A little gargoyle. Love these. <laughs> There's yeah, a no, cauldron. Oh. Yeah. 
I just tested that, it's missing the button, but it still works. Oh my goodness, Mike. Love this little guy. Look at his little feet. Found this super cute little pumpkin mug. Oh my goodness, I can see like a pumpkin teapot to go with the pumpkin mug back there. Are you excited? That's it, that's enough for you. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Amazing amethyst. Little snowman. We're just heading now to that bookshop that I talked about earlier because I love that bookshop. I still haven't resigned. Sat down under a staring at the sea, yeah. Oh well. How does that sound go? By the seaside. Look at that, guys. Oh, what? Swinging frog. Yeah. <laughs> that was good. So, we've had a drink. And now, so we had a drink, so now we're off to that shop that I talked about originally, which was shut until 11, but it's now, my Fitbit's dead, um, probably about one or something like that. Life's flex, Lizzie. So, what? <laughs> my old ass flip bit. Flip bit. Anyway, let's hope it's open now. I see a seagull right there. That's a perfect mini beach for parents though, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Shop for going is just that one there in case you want to go check it out yourself.
I like how judgy he is. He's like judging every move. This guy is my favorite. Do you think his eyes kind of look? Mike found a mic to match his mic. mic. Got a mini. I'm pretty sure the wind was best So many top comes, it's unreal. Is that a gambling frog? <clears throat> I think it is. Like Jurassic Park. I'm just gonna look on the craft side. Ooh. So we're just walking up to the car now. We decided to leave Lyme Regis. Well, we're still there obviously. We're just walking to the car um, and head off to Weymouth now to go look for some lunch slash dinner. So after a hella long walk up a hill and a traumatic exit to the car park, we have finally escaped Lyme Regis. And we are now on our way to Weymouth to have a look around. We've been to Weymouth like 48,000 times. So hopefully we'll see a seagull there. So we got to um, Weymouth. Don't know if you can tell, but there's we're on a- G -H. We're on level GH and there's also a TK Maxx here, so no. perhaps <laughs> there'll be some Halloween stuff. Gotcha. Maybe. It's like the most ratchet <laughs> lift. It's just like Chad Fisher. <laughs> I love the fact that it goes in numbers. Ground floor. I'd love to say it's an emergency. <laughs> sorry, it's already broken. <laughs> oh, no, I don't think it works in numbers. <laughs> Yeah, we'll just do a quick scan. A quick scan, just, just in case. Oh my goodness, that was so cute. Just in case you see anything spooky, pumpkin alert is what we're on. Thought that was a ghost, but um, it's like some weird frog monster. We are going up, <laughs> Mike is falling asleep, we're going up to the home section to see if there's any pumpkins. Doesn't look like there's any pumpkins le yet, what's he left, it won't even come out yet. Oh look, it matches my dress, it's cute, oh I like that. It's all cut up on the back. I can confirm that uh, there were no pumpkins, sadly, since it is still May. So, we're just looking to get some like lunch dinner. We went to this place like six months or so ago. It is really nice, it's on like the seafront. All the bear. Um, so we're gonna go back again. I think I had Hunter's chicken last time, which was really nice. And um, so I'll probably get something similar. I think Mike's just gonna get a starter or something, but We'll see, but it's this really cute, like, little place, and then we're gonna go get ice cream after. So I've gone for the Hunter's Chicken, and I think Mike is just getting some cheesy chips, which I'm very jealous of. Oh. So we've just finished eating, and it was amazing. Did you like yours, Mike? Yeah. Good. It was so yummy. 
um, and I think now we're on an ice cream hunt. So we've eaten and it's now um, 20 to 4 so we're going to head back now, we need to go to Sainsbury's on the way home um, and then just have a chill night and digest like pythons. And here is a interesting looking brooch. Premium content here on this channel. So we are home. Back with Tiddly Bear. Right. Let me show you her cool trick. High five. Good girl. Oh, you're so clever. Ready? There you go. Oh, you good girl. Oh, she's a good girl. Oh, yummy, yummy, yummy. Hi guys, so just changed into some pyjamas. I've given my hair a bit of a cut um, just because it needed a bit of a trim. It looks crazy because I've got it up in, in like a um, scrunchie. Um, but I always have it so like it's in like a V shape. So like there's always like one bit that's longer if that makes sense. Um, but I've given my hair a cut so it's a bit shorter now. But um, let me just take it down. It's a little bit shorter now as you can see. Um, but it definitely feels a lot nicer. Um, I'm still really liking this colour. I can't decide with my next henna if I should put um, some like red semi permanent in there or if I should stick with like this colour that's going on now. Do let me know what you think down below. Um, so yeah, I think the plan is now Mike's having a shower and stuff. Um, just going to relax a bit and maybe watch a bit of Netflix. I think I'm going to now put um, all of these clips onto my editor and start editing them together so hopefully I can upload this for you soon. Oh really exciting, well good news and bad news. I was looking through Aliexpress like the whole way home because I wanted to find some more Killstar outfits and I found Killstar like knockoff tights, um, the Curses chain belt finally and also a velvet dress so I've ordered all of those to come um, so that's really exciting so I have like three more like Wish versus Aliexpress videos I did also order another dress from Aliexpress like a week ago but I just checked and it said if the seller doesn't ship it within two days I'm gonna get a refund so I didn't know that was a thing with Aliexpress but like if it doesn't work I'll just order it again because I really really wanted to try out that dress hi guys so if you cannot tell I am now back home <laughs> It is currently uh, one in the morning and I'm just finishing editing this video and I realized I forgot to say goodbye as usual um, so thank you very much for watching if you do have any questions or comments please leave them down below if it's anywhere you are I hope you enjoy the shade and I will see you next time bye